what's up guys today we are watching the third x-men movie now i know there's not a reaction video to the second movie and that's only because it just wasn't able to upload whenever i was uploading it it got blocked and i tried editing it to the point where it was able to post but it just didn't work so it's not uploaded and i just gave up eventually because i just did it too much you know and it didn't seem like it was gonna work so but I'm glad I'm getting back into the movies. Like I felt like I feel like I haven't seen an X Men movie in an, probably about a month, and that's just kind of too long. Um, I'm just I'm mostly ready to to see Hugh Jackman. Hugh Jackman is my favorite. <laughs> but um, in the last movie, towards the end, I remember I was pretty blown because Jean died. Or at least I thought she died, but pulling up the movie, like on the poster, she was on it. So apparently she's still alive, and I don't know how that worked. So I guess let's just get into the movie. <laughs> Are we starting off in a flashback or something? Because it seems like it's starting too, too long ago. 20 years ago. Okay. I still don't know why I'm here. Don't you think? Yeah, the brochure is great. But what about Jean? What about her illness? Illness? John. Oh, wait. These are Jean's parents? Kind. We are mutants, Jean. We are like you. Really? I doubt that. So she was a kid with an attitude. Stanley. <laughs> Is he scratching his back with a knife? How do you? Dad, I'm sorry. <laughs> so he had wings and he just cut them off? Did she cut her hair or was it already short in the last one? <laughs> okay, Bobby. Why did I think she was the other girl for a second? Logan, we work as a team. Yeah, good luck with that. Throw me. Now. Damn it, Logan, don't do this. He asked to be thrown. Class dismissed. Hey, Colossus. Nice throw. That was a simulation? Okay. They got advanced technology. Oh, they always have, but... Scott's still trying to cope with Jean being gone. Well, for now. Hey, I don't think that's fair. Have I ever put any pressure on you? You're a guy, Bobby. Your mind's only on one thing. Uh, that's kind of mean to say, but... Don't. When Jean died, I said don't. 
Maybe it's time for us to move on. He's low-key acting like he was the only one who was hurt by Jean dying. Mr. Secretary? Yes. What a weird way to sit. Okay. Nav sat and lost him crossing the border, but we did get a consolation prize. We picked her up, breaking to the FDA of all places. You know who she's been imitating? They really picked up. What's her name? I forgot her name. Not anymore, she can't. Be a step ahead this time. Where is Magneto? Raven. Raven, I asked you a question. Raven? I thought her name was something else. Raven Darkholm, that's you. My family tried to kill me, you pathetic meat sack. Okay, then, Mystique. Um, oh, yeah, Mystique. So she ended up killing him. Able to use our power, and when do we cross that invisible line that turns us into tyrants over our fellow man? But Einstein said that ethics are an exclusive human. Elliot Page. Superhuman authority behind it. Dang. I'm sorry. Change the weather just like that. I thought of you as my student for years. In fact, I thought that perhaps you might take my place someday. I don't know why I thought she would ask Scott. Yeah. A way to suppress the mutant X gene. Suppress? Permanently. They're calling it a cure. Rogue might want that cure since she touches people and they die. Since when did we become a disease? My boy, I have been fighting for mutant rights since before you had claws. Did he just call me boy? Is it true? They can cure us? She might want it. And then one day when the air is still and the night has fallen, they come for you. Excuse me. Only then you Oh yeah, that was the kid that was on their side at first, but then went over to Magneto's side. Other than you two. You can sense other mutants in their power. Mm -hmm. Wait, so she's fast and she can do that? So she has two powers? I'm gonna kill you myself. <laughs> you yeah, right. She's gonna escape. I mean, it's Mystique. I just wonder how she's gonna do it. Like, by herself? Or are they gonna come for her and help her escape? What the hell? I'm sorry. It's okay. Wait, is he meant to be the cure? Like if he like looks at someone, touches someone? Well, all I did was just like change his skin color. How would that affect Rogue? And it grows back. That means her body is somewhere around, or like just in the water right there. That was kind of extreme, Scott. But you're hurt. I get it. Oh, 
the fuck was that? It was just a hole, and then, bam, a wave that freaking knocked you down. Jeep? How? Was she the sea monster thingy that was at the end of the last movie? That's what I was thinking at first, but I wasn't sure. But it's like, how? She does what Professor X could do. Or something like that. But I'm... I like her hair. Take these off. Does she not remember about his eyes? So she can control his eyes? How does- how does that work? What does that mean? What was that? Is that like actually not her? Scott's glasses. Should have obliterated her completely. The only explanation of Jean's survival is that her powers wrapped her in a cocoon of telekinetic energy. But what happened to Scott? Scott wasn't there. Is she gonna be okay? Came to call itself the Phoenix. A purely instinctual creature, all desire and joy and rage. So she's not her, but her other personality? Well, sounds to me like Jean had no choice at all. I don't have to explain myself. Least of all to you. Don't come at him like that. He's just worried about her. Excuse me, sir. Your son's arrived. Good. Bring him in. You sure you want to start with him? I think it's important. Who's his son? He was a little boy from earlier. The one that cut off his wings. I just realized. what we all want. It's what you want. It's what you want. That's what I said. This is how Mystique's getting out. He's gonna be the one to help her escape. About time. I've been busy. Did you find what you were looking for? The source of the cure is a mutant, a child at Worthington Labs. So it is the kid that's the cure. But he didn't totally cure that dude though. It came back after like a few minutes, so... Well, a few seconds. At the same time. I could use a man of your talents. I'm in. Eric Dane? Since when are you in X-Men movies? Go back to Grey's- well... Yeah, he's not in Grey's Anatomy at this time. This came out in what, 2003, 2006? So it healed her? Sorry, my dear. You're not one of us anymore. You're straight up gonna leave her? You saved her. She got tranquilized with that shit. And you just left her. Gee. 
Matt Jean, other Jean. This definitely ain't her because she was not going to try and do some shit because of Scott. Again, we're Scott. So she keeps going like between herself and then her other personality. Look at me. Look at me. Focus. Focus, Jean. Kill me. No. Don't ask him to do that. God damn, it's like you never know when she's gonna switch back and forth. It's her magnetic force. It's massive. It's a mutant. Class 5. More powerful than anything I've ever felt. More Jean? Maybe it's Jean. I think she killed Scott. Are you really telling me that that's going to be the last time we see Scott? It's like, I know he wasn't maybe particularly my favorite, but I didn't want him to die. Eric, stop! No, Charles, not this time. You've always held her back. For your own good, Jean. Stay out of my head. I wouldn't mess with her right now. She seems too, too powerful. I think you want to give her the cure. Look what happened to Scott. You killed the man you loved because you couldn't control your power. No, stop it! I shouldn't have brought that up. Especially at a time like that. I love that. Okay. God damn, her f her face is changing and everything. How are you lifting a whole house? Are you gonna kill Professor X? No way. No. How? So he died twice. Because he died in Logan. But that's set in the future. And he just died then. So she killed him, and she's gonna be on Magneto, Magneto's team, this movie. It's the destiny of great men to see their goals unfulfilled. Charles was more than a leader, more than a teacher. He was a friend. We I really afraid, just want to, like, not believe that he's dead, because we alone, if they killed him that early in the damn movies, like... Storm told us to stay in our rooms. Don't worry, we won't get caught. I mean, you can walk through walls, you know. <laughs> Come on. Lisa, she's the one that could walk through walls. I thought, I thought the, 
I thought she was younger, like way younger in the other movies. <laughs> Bobby's such a good friend. think something's going on and she's leaving okay need a lift kid shouldn't you be telling me to stay to go upstairs and unpack i'm not your father i'm your friend and that's why i love their friendship <laughs> I really thought she was about to do it for a second. He wanted to hold you back. What do you want? Charles Xavier did more for mutants than you'll ever know. My single greatest regret is that he had to die for our dream to live. So he just backed him up. <laughs> As Xavier started this school, perhaps it's best that it end with him. We'll have to tell the students that they're going home. Most of us don't have anywhere to go. He wants to end the school. I can't believe this. Rogue. Hey, Rogue. She actually left? Hey, Pete. That's what happened before Scott died. He heard her voice everywhere. Now he's gonna leave too? What the hell? You don't know that. She killed the professor. It wasn't Jean. The Jean I know is still in there. Oh, so he's going after her. He's not leaving, leaving. Wait, does he think? I'm looking for someone. Yeah, he thinks Rogue went there oh, I get it. to get the cure. So she did end up going, just not whenever Bobby went. I didn't think you'd win there. Oh, but he got stabbed too? Yeah. But he's gonna heal. The other dude doesn't have healing powers. We shall go to Alcatraz Island! Take control of the cure! And destroy its source! And then, nothing can- She sees him. Is she gonna, like, just let him go? How did we find it? She gave us everything we wanted and more. Hell hath no cure. Oh, that's Mystique. She turned she turned against him since they left her. Okay. Send them in. Okay. I think they would have sensed them or something, so. <laughs> I give up. No way. Sorry, Mr. Secretary. It was a decoy. If he's not there, then where the hell is We're in. Let's go. It feels so weird without Rogue there. 
They're ready. Yeah, I know. But are you ready to do what you need to do when the time comes? Little they know, well, little does he know, they're going for him. <laughs> like that out. No metal, but they have her, so. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> Come on! Grow those back. <laughs> I've seen this scene on TikTok before. I just didn't know it was from this movie. Calm down, calm down. Everything's gonna be okay. Mm, that's kind of brutal. We're gonna get you out of here. This way. On. Your powers won't work. Uh, her powers don't work in there. Who's hiding, dickhead? His powers don't work in there too, so. <laughs> Maybe he might give the cure to Jean instead of killing her. I don't know. Cause I don't know if he would actually kill her. I'm ready to see their fight off. Don't tell me you're gonna kill Bobby. He went full ice. That's dope as fuck. Gave him all four? God damn. God damn, the amount of damage she can do. Pain he's going through just to be able to help her. Uh, you would die for them. No, not for them. For you. For you.
I really just feel so bad because he was the one that had to kill her. I thought maybe he'd give her the cure or something. I can't believe Jean's actually gone now. She was one of my favorites. And then the fact that earlier in the movie was like the last time we saw Scott. So three people died. Rogue doesn't have powers now. He's just a regular dude now. Mm-mm. I really can't believe that they killed Dr. X off like that. Professor X. I called him Doctor. I meant Professor X. So they killed him off. They killed off Jean. They killed off Scott. And the way that Logan was the one that had to kill Jean. Why make his life harder? That just made me feel so bad for him. But now, what's her name? Storm. Storm's gonna be running the school. So I'm kind of interested in seeing how she's gonna be like handling things in the next movie. But I'm also kind of confused because I didn't think they would kill off Professor X that early into the movies. I feel like they're gonna find some way for him to come back or something. But I could just be wrong and maybe that is when he died. I don't know. It's just, it's just so sad. So Jean killed him, and she died. I hate that. I hate how that went down. And then, what's it called? Rogue doesn't have her powers anymore. Mystique doesn't have her powers anymore. I know Mystique's gonna be in more X-Men movies because like, I'm not that dumb. Like I've seen posters from like other movies and stuff so I know she's gonna be there but like it's just so weird and I just wonder how she's gonna get her powers back or maybe it's like a past kind of her I don't know I'm just guessing at this point stuff's just running through my mind <laughs> but honestly that movie it was good up until Jean, Jean died. It's mostly Jean. I liked Scott, but like, to an extent, you know. But I still didn't want to see him die. But it's like, they didn't even show his death. I, how did Jean kill him? Because it just went dark. Maybe she made the lasers go off in his head. I don't know. I'm just like thinking about it right now. I just want to know how he died. But that movie sets it up kind of pretty well for the next movie. Like, I really want to know what Storm's going to be doing with the school. Because now it's mostly just her and Logan running the place because all their other friends are dead. And then they have, you know, Rogue, Bobby, and them. I guess come back for the fourth X-Men movie. <laughs>